Hey guys, it's your boy, Peter John. Welcome to the last episode of the Logo History W, a series which you request one or two logos here in the comments and I will pick the most liked one. Sadly, I have to end this series as I know you guys aren't interested in it as much as the other series, and because I can't do something if people don't really like since I'm basically wasting my time. This series has also been target of criticism regarding the logos that were being picked to talk about. Unfortunately, some other series of this channel are gonna have the same end soon, but until then please keep watching all the videos. But alright, as this is the last episode, I've decided to pick all the 5 most liked requests, so today I'm going to talk about Audi, KTAZ, KSAZ TV, Pepsi Boom, Margarita New York Jets, Logo History K, Logo History Wheel and KBC Your Place for Media, that were requested by Yeet Man, Alejandro 2180, Aiden Logos, Ty, and KBC Your Place for Media. Check out his channel by clicking on the cards above. I hope you like it. First, I'm gonna talk about Logo History K. It is a Logo History series created by Kai. 2021 to the present, there is an orange rectangle, and inside it there are the words Logo History and K in white text. Here is an intro. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Logo History Wheel. It is a Logo History series created by Kai. 2021 to the present, there is a rainbow rectangle, and on it there are the words Logo History and Wheel in white text. Here is an intro. Alright, now I'm gonna talk about KBC Your Place for Media. It is a YouTube channel that was created on June 24, 2021, and which has one sub at the time I'm doing this video. 2021 to the present, there is the word KBC Media in dark blue text. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about KTAZ. It is a Telemundo-owned and operated television station licensed to Phoenix, Arizona, United States. 2001 to 2002, here we have the logo of the first KTAZ's name, KPHZ. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 2002 to 2006, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 2006 to 2012, they changed its name to KTAZ. There is a blue letter T, and on it there is a white line, and on the right of the letter T there is a blue number 39, and under it there is the word Telemundo in blue text. Here is a bumper. twenty twelve to twenty seventeen, there are two red shapes representing a letter T, and under them there is the word Telemundo in black text, and under it there is the word Arizona in red text. Here is a bumper. Noticiero Telemundo Arizona te informa primero a las cinco. 2017 to 2018, the word Arizona was replaced with the word Phoenix. 2018 to the present, the shapes are now 2D, and the text is now in gray text. All right, now I'm gonna talk about Margarita. It is a Colombian-based business unit, which handles many brands associated with Frito-Lay, as well as some products unique to Colombia. 1950 to 1987, there are four dark blue shapes, and between them there is the word Margarita in white text on a red outline, and above it there is a panda head wearing a red hat. 1987 to 1997, there is a white rounded shape on a blue outline, and on it there is a panda head wearing a red hat, and under the head there is the word Margarita in red text, and under it there are the words K Buena and Papa in black text. 1997 to 2004, there is a green shape on a red and blue outline, and inside it there is a panda smiling, and under it there is the word Margarita in red text on a white outline. 2004 to 2008 there is a yellow circle, and on it there is a red banner, and inside it there is the word Margarita in white text. 2008 to 2019 and 2019 to 2020 is a secondary logo, there is a golden sphere, and on it there is a red banner, and inside it there is the word Margarita in white text. Margarita 2019 to 2020, the logo is now 2D. 2020 to the present, the logo now has shadows. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about New York Jets. They are a professional American football team based in the New York metropolitan area. 
1960-1962, here we have the logo of the first New York Jets name, New York Titans. There is a blue drawing of a football player, and on the right of it there is the word the in blue text, and under it there is the word Titans in dark yellow text on a blue outline, and under it there are the words of New and York in blue text. 1963-1963, they changed its name to New York Jets. There is a green plane, and inside it there is the word Jets in white text. 1964 to 1966, there is a green outline of a football, and inside it there is the word nigh in white text on a green outline, and on it there is the word jets in green text, and under it there is a green football. 1967 to 1977, the bigger football is now fully green, the outline of the word nigh is now white, the word jets is now in white text, and the smaller football is now white. 1978 to 1997, there is a green shape, and under it there is the word jets in green text. 1998 to 2018, there is a dark green rounded shape, and inside it there is the white outline of the word nigh, and on it there is the word jets in white text, and under it there is a white football. Here is a commercial. In 2009, we started something. In 2010, in the new Jet Stadium, we intend to finish it. It's go time. 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 Call 800 469 Jets now for tickets. 2019 to the present, there is a green rounded shape on a white outline that looks like a football, and inside it there are the words new and york in white text, and under them there is the word jets in white text, and under it there is a white football. All right, now I'm gonna talk about Pepsi Boom. It was a version of Diet Pepsi without caffeine, or artificial sweeteners only sold in Germany, Italy, and Spain. 1991 to 1996, there is the word Pepsi in blue text, and under it there is a gray explosion, and on it there is the word boom in yellow text on a blue outline, and on the right of it there is the word old Pepsi logo that consisted in two shapes one red and one blue divided by a white line. Here is a commercial. Avete notato che quello che ci piace fare non si può fare? Gridare! Turcarsi! Saltare sui letti! Ma adesso c'è una cosa che ci piacerà fare e nessuno ci potrà fermare. Bere la nuova Pepsi Boom! <ride> Siete svegli? Pepsi Boom! Senza caffeina. 1996 to 1998. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 1998 to 2003, there are the words sin and caffeina in white text and on a blue outline, and under them there is the word Pepsi in vertical blue text on a white outline, and on the right of it there is that old Pepsi logo, and under it there is a red explosion on a white outline, and on it there is the word boom in blue text on a white outline, and under the explosion there is a blue clapperboard, and on it there are the words can see gloss pelliculas and doramen in dark blue text. Here is a commercial. Chaval. Los auténticos superhéroes están en los tabonazos de Pepsi Boom. Coleccionalos. 2003 to 2008, there are the words sin and caffeina in yellow text, and under them there is the word Pepsi in blue text on a white outline, and under it there is a red explosion, and on it there is the word boom in blue text, and on the right of the explosion there is the old Pepsi logo. Here is a commercial. <laughs> 2008 to 2010, there is the old Pepsi logo, and under it there is the word Pepsi in blue text on a white outline, and under it there is the word boom in white text. 2010 to 2014, there is the current Pepsi logo, and under it there is the word Pepsi in blue text, and under it there is the word boom in white text on a dark green outline. 2014 to 2019, the word Pepsi is smaller, and the word boom is now on the middle, not on a outline anymore and now it's in blue text. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Audi. 
It is a German automotive manufacturer of luxury vehicles headquartered in Ingolstadt, Bavaria, Germany. 1909 to 1909 is a pre-launch logo, there is the word Audi in great text. 1909 to 1910, there is a white and black number one, and under it there is a black and white shape, and under it there is a black triangle, and inside it there is the word Audi in white text. Here is the word mark. 1910 to 1932, the font has changed. 1932 to 1949, they changed its name to Auto Union. Now there are four dark blue rings, and inside the first one there is what was Audi's logo previously, and inside the second ring there is a dark blue triangle on a dark blue shield, and with the letters DK and W in white text on the triangle, and inside the third ring there is the word Horch in dark blue text, and under it there is a dark blue letter H, and inside the last ring there is a dark blue letter W, and under it there is a dark blue banner, and inside it there is the word automobile in white text. 1949 to 1969, there are four gray rings, and on them there is a white shape, and inside it, there are the words auto and union in gray text. Here is the print version and a commercial. Man nehme einen DKW F11, nehme dazu die ganze Familie, nehme Putzi am Schlawittchen, nehme ruhig auch noch die Oma mit, nehme so viel Koffer wie man Lust hat, und gebe Gas. Oder aber, man nehme einen DKW F12. Nehme damit elegant und sicher jede Kurve. Nehme spielend jede Steigung und die höchsten Pässe. Nehme am Ziel einen kühlen Trunk und gebe dem treuen Gefährten auch einen Schluck. Oder man nehme einen F12 Roadster, nehme dazu ein hübsches Mädchen, nehme Kurs nach dem sonnigen Süden, nehme das Leben von seiner schönsten Seite und gebe, pst, aber doch nicht jetzt. Nehmen Sie einen guten Rat an, nehmen Sie einen DKW von Autounion. F11, F12. F12 Roadster. F12 Roadster, offen, sportlich, komfortabel. F12, alles drin, alles dran. F11, durch und durch wirtschaftlich. Drei aus gutem Hause. Ihr Auto-Union-Händler stellt sie Ihnen vor. 1969 to 1969, they changed its name to Audi NSU. There is a black rectangle and inside it there are the words Audi and NSU in white text. 1969 to 1995, they changed its name back again to Audi. There is a black rounded shape, and inside it there is the word Audi in white text. Here is the word mark, here is the blue version, the badge and a commercial. Dieser Wagen hat 115 PS. Er ist in 9,9 Sekunden auf 100 und 185 Dauerschnell. Mit Frontantrieb. Er hat die sportliche Exklusivausstattung. Audi 100 Coupé S für eine neue Sportfahrerklasse. 1978 to 1995, the shape is now red. Here is the print version, the blue version and the commercial. From 1995 to 2009, there are four silver rings, and under them there is the word Audi in red text. Here is the print version, the 2D version, the wordmark and a variant of the wordmark and a commercial.
Ted Boykin is a salesman, a dynamite salesman. He could sell a plate of ribs to a woman wearing white gloves. And if you ask Ted about his new Audi A4, he'll sell you in a second. He'll rhapsodize about its sporty yet elegant design, impress you with its German engineering, and put the hammer down with its affordable price. Yeah, Ted would love to tell you all about his A4, as long as he isn't on the job. The new A4, available wherever Audi cars are sold. 2009 to 2016, the font has changed, the rings are shinier, and the text is now smaller and on the left. Here is the black version, the gray version and the commercial. Look at you, so dashing. Come on. Nowadays, lots of people go by themselves. No, they don't. Yeah. Hey, son. Have fun tonight. From 2016 to the present, the text has been removed, and the rings are now black. Here is a variant used in the pandemic and the commercial. Here's a question. Was it necessary to create a luxury car more teched out than Silicon Valley? With a cockpit fit for a spaceship. Hang on. Radar that senses things the human eye can't. Busted. Hey, and the ability to make a thousand decisions before you even make one. Was all this really necessary? What do you think? All right, now I'm gonna talk about KSAZ TV. It is a Fox owned and operated television station licensed to Phoenix, Arizona, United States. 1953 to 1955, here we have the logo of the first KSAZ TV's name, Cool TV. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 1955 to 1964, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 1964 to 1968, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 1968 to 1975, there is a CBS logo that consists in a black circle inside a black shape, and on the right of the logo, there is a black number 10, and under it, there are the words a CBS affiliate and Cool TV in black text. 1975 to 1977, there are the words a CBS and affiliate in black text, and under them there is the CBS logo, and on the right of it, there is a black number 10. Here is a bumper. K-O-O-L TV Channel 10 Phoenix. 1977 to 1982, there is a white number 10, and under it there is the word Cool TV in white text, and on the right of it, there is a white CBS logo, and under it, there is the word Cool TV in white text, and on the right of it, there is a white CBS logo, and on the right of it, there are the words 10 and Phoenix in white text. Here is a bumper. Blessed is a nation whose God is the Lord. K-O-O-L TV Channel 10 Phoenix. 1982 to 1987, here we have the logo of the second KSAZ TV's name, KTSP TV. There is a yellow and orange circle, and inside it there is a white number 10. Here is a variant and a bumper. We've got a way of doing things here in Arizona today. A certain style, a certain flair that comes through every day.
1987 to 1989, there is an orange circle, and inside it there is a golden number 10, and under the circle, there are the words KTSPTV and Phoenix in white text. Here is a bumper. News Center 10 live at 5 with Deborah Pyburn Brewer and Dave Patterson, Dave Muncy with weather, Fred Khalil with sports, and the team from News Center 10. 1989 to 1991, there is a yellow circle, and inside it, there is a white number 10, and under the circle, there is the word KTSPTV in black text. Here is a bumper. 10. The new vision of progress. 1991 to 1994, there is a blue circle, and inside it, there is a white number 10. Here is a bumper. Donna Cordova. Pat Flanagan. This is the Channel 10 News at Noon. 1994 to 1996, they changed its name to KSAZ-TV. There is a blue circle, and inside it there is a white number 10, and on the right of the circle there is the word XAZ in blue text except the letter S that is in red text, and which has a white star on it, and under the word XAZ there is a dark blue rectangle, and inside it there are the words Spirit of and Arizona in white text. Here is a bumper. From Channel 10, KSAZ, the Spirit of Arizona. Claire and Scott, Rick D'Amico, with Dave Muncy and Todd Whitthorn. This is Channel 10 News at 5. 1996 to 1997, there is a black rectangle, and inside it there are four white searchlights, and between them there is the word Fox in white text, and on the right of the rectangle there is a red rectangle, and inside it there is a white number 10. Here is the 3D version and a bumper. This is Fox 10 where we don't mind if you stare. 1997 to 2006, now under the previous logo there is a white rectangle, and inside it there are the words XAZ TV and Phoenix in black text, and under the white rectangle there is a red rectangle. Here is a bumper. Now, live from Studio A, this is Fox 10 News Special Edition. 2006 to the present, there is a red rectangle, and inside it there is the word Fox in white text, and under the red rectangle there is a dark blue rectangle, and inside it there are four white searchlights, and between them there is a white number 10, and under the dark blue rectangle there is a red rectangle, and inside it there is the word Phoenix in white text. Here is the print version, the horizontal version, the 3D version and a bumper. Live from Fox Studios, Fox 10 News is back. Okay guys, this is it for today. Thanks everyone who has been requesting for this series for the last two years, and everyone who has already participated in it. And I hope you enjoyed today's video, because it really took me a long time to produce. I am Peter John, this is Logo History W and this was its last episode, bye.